But we're all in this together, right? We're all tired as hell together. Thanks, kids. This is a happy song about my wife who's right over there. She's selling my stuff. And she also makes amazing guitar string jewelry. You should check it out. She's got stuff from Green Sky, Bluegrass, and Keller Williams. And she also has stuff from rock stars like Old Shoe, sometimes the Way Down Wanderers, and other people like that. The big acts, you know? Like me. Here on the main stage. All my troubles and all of my blues. Will you take a back seat when I'm with you? And all of my friends and my guitars too. Will you take a back seat when I'm with you? Cause you and me, baby, we drive around. You fix me up when, when I break down. And you're all that I need, babe. And you're all that I want. That's why I got to have you here up front. All my troubles and all my blues. Well, they take a back seat when I'm with you. And all of my friends and my guitars too. Well, they take a back seat when I'm with you. When I'm with you, I get a little lost. Points of interest come and cross when I'm with you. All the nights on fire, eyes are wide when the road ties. Been married for nine years in July. Thank you. One morning we woke up in Chicago and I was living in this apartment with seven other dudes. And we've been together for four days. And she said, we gotta get out of here. And I said, I agree. I said, what do you want to do? And she said, I don't know. And she said, what do you want to do? And I said, I don't know. And that went on for an hour and a half. She had nothing to do because it was early May and she's a teacher. <laughs> I had nothing to do because it was early May and I was a musician. So I decided just to go for it, y'all. I decided to go for it. I said, well, hey, do you want to go to a Cubs game? And she said, sure. And on the outside, I said, cool. And on the inside, I said, cha-ching. I knew she was the one. So we took a train to another train, and we took that train to a bus, and we took that bus to another bus, and then to a train, and we walked a few blocks to beautiful Wrigley Field. And for the Cardinal people out there, let's just say on this particular day, the Cubs were playing the cards. And let's just say, for story purposes, the Cardinals won. And for story purposes, the final score was 14 to 2. Because the Cubs, if you haven't noticed, weren't always good. So we went up there to the window, and we got to the window. And the woman at the window said, sorry kids, today's game is sold out. Apparently a bunch of Central Illinois Cardinal fans went up there and bought all the damn tickets. So I had to think of something fast, ladies and gentlemen. I'd only been dating this girl for four days and I couldn't go down like that. So I ducked into this alley and I ran into this guy named Teeth. And Teeth had helped me out before with a few other things in the past. And I said, Teeth, for old time's sake, can you do me a solid? And I kid you not, you can ask her now or after the set, it's true. Out of his back pocket, he pulled out two tickets to the sold out Cubs Cards game. And I walked out of that alley feeling so damn cool that I could come through for my new girlfriend. And she said, how did you pull that off? And I said, that's nothing. Wait until nine years from now, I'm gonna take you to summer camp in Chillicothe, Illinois. And you can sell your jewelry and I'll sell my music and we'll play for a bunch of hippies and bikers and good old people who support live music and know that music is alive and it's not dead and know that songs are important. She said,
said, I look forward to it. So we got into Wrigley, and this elderly gentleman pointed us to our seats, and he pointed upward. So we started walking upward, and we kept walking, and we kept walking, until we finally got to our seats in upper left field behind a giant ass pole. <laughs> I said, Teeth, you done me wrong again. I thought we were pals. But let me tell you something, summer camp, that girl never complained one time. And we sat there behind that pole for three hours. And we drank warm, old-style beer. And we drank cold nachos. And being early May in Chicago, it was 11 degrees. And she still never complained. And she hasn't complained in the last nine years. And a couple days ago, she said, what are we doing this weekend? And I said, remember nine years ago when I told you about Summer Camp Music Festival in Chillicothe, Illinois, where we're going to hang out with Old Chew and the Way Down Wanderers and Green Sky Bluegrass and all of our friends. And we were, we're even going to have a good time with the dubstep kids. And she said, is that this weekend? And I said, hell yeah. And she says, damn it, I can't wait. Which brings us to this moment right now. And it just goes to show you that these songs are working. Because I ended up marrying that girl. These songs work.